Cheers. <laughs> I barely tapped it, dude. <laughs> <laughs>what's going on guys i am matthias it's raining outside welcome to 10 strange amazon items are they dope or nope i hope because <laughs> if they're right in the middle i'm gonna say grope <laughs> dope number grope dude <laughs> off to a great start guys tanner has joined me here he has picked out 10 items i'm gonna let you know whether these items are dope or no okay nimble the one finger safety cutter cut paper and packaging with one finger joey already does that <laughs> <laughs> Cut <Yeah>. two! <laughs> oh, I see, I see. If you want to pretend like you're magic, but really you have a sharp tip. Can relate. Can relate. <laughs> so this is good because it's not going to wreck what's inside your junk. You know what I'm saying? It's not gonna wreck what's inside your package. I'm gonna use this to open up all the packages of today. I'm so excited. It's raining outside. Did I mention that? Add to cart. Nimble. It's so nimble. Quick question. How do I open this? <laughs> actually, they thought of that. It's actually somewhat easy to open. Man, that is actually tiny. Okay, yeah. It works? Yeah, pretty well too. Can you give me a box to open or what, dude? Maybe I do, maybe I don't, okay? Bam, look at okay, that. Okay, so wait, this looks like it was taped six times. It looks like it was taped once, you tested it, and you decided to put more tape on, but you ran out of this black tape, so you only put clear tape on. No. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's see. I choose to plead the fifth. Oh, yeah. Wow. Well, let's see the sides, let's see the sides. That's always the toughest Ooh, part. Ooh, no, that's tough. No, that's not. Well, I, I did get it. I couldn't feel it being got. Does that make sense? I'm imp Yeah, you couldn't get it getting got. That's not bad. Like, I'll give this a dope, but the sides are a little difficult. With a knife, you slide it under it, and then you just go like that, so it's a little quicker. <laughs> I'm sure some of you have accidentally cut yourself, so this may be good for you. Next product. Akmart adjustable mini footrest stand office desk feet hammock. So it's a hammock for your feet. I'm gonna tell you right now, I think this is pretty dumb. I would feel like never stable. Does that make sense? Yeah. Especially if your chair is like swivel. You know, you're just gonna be like going like this the entire time, you know? Like a mermaid. Yeah, like a mermaid, right? You got your feet stuck together. I, I don't know, like as someone who man spreads, I think this will prevent man spreading and I don't like that. I wanna spread my madness to as far as I can. All over the world. <laughs> All over the world I wanna spread this manliness. Yeah, that's why I'm making this video today. <laughs> to let you know, it's okay to be a man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm on that again. Yeah, I was like, I feel like we've done this before. <laughs> it's okay to be a man. It's okay to like manly things. Look at my beard. Oh. Everyone in the comments was like, no, I hate your beard. Go back, go back. But the truth is, you're scared of change. This beard looks dope as heck on me. It does. I wouldn't say it's a manly beard, but I'd say it's a good beard. Really? You don't think this is a manly beard? This is about as manly as you can get. Dog. It's taken care of, dog. And... It's thick. You see that? You can't see my skin under there. That's some thick beard, yo! That's right. If you want to complain about my beard in the comments, it's your prerogative to do so, but it's my prerogative to delete you. <laughs> <laughs> Add to cart. <laughs> Here's the thing. Amanda likes the beard, right? So if you know she likes it, you know it's going to stay. Because I care about making her happy. Mm -hmm. I don't really care about you that much. And you'll be happy too, because I kiss her. You don't want me to kiss you. <laughs> <laughs> Man, you really have to put a lot of work into relaxing. <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> that's the irony of a hammock. You gotta hang it up. And that's the least relaxing thing you could possibly do. Where are we gonna put this? Well, look at that. Let's put it on the table. Okay, here we go. Wait, where are the screws though? Oh, what? This is how it does it? Yeah. Oh, for real? <laughs> I thought I had to screw it into the table. All right, oh. here we go. <laughs> you're not fixing like, a car. <laughs> you're just putting a hammock in. At least I know how. Hey, let me see what's under the hood of your table. Okay, there we go. Put that on like that. I don't like how loose this is on the table. Loosey goosey. Like what? So you're sitting under here. You got to find it. Okay, not super difficult. And then... <laughs> just how uneven these are gives me anxiety. Like you're just sliding this thing off. <laughs> now I can do all my work! You like, laugh too hard watching a meme? <laughs> <laughs> oh Jesus, oh! That almost flung up and hit me in the brain, dude! Other than that sweet karma. I don't know, I think you can get it to work. Obviously I'm being uh, facetious, but I mean, what's the actual practical application here, you know? I think it's... <laughs> <laughs> Alright, that's a good cut point. <laughs> Next item is an item. Rock board descend. Oh, I clicked an ad! Rock board descend. 
For Ralphs? I didn't know they were still a thing. Anyways, <laughs> what I was trying to say was the next item is a dope or no. You know what that means? That means in a previous video, I was like, hey, hey, do you want to see me buy this expensive item? Give this video likes. Here's what I said. $120, I have to know if you guys want me to make a video about this. See, I told you I said it. This video gets 85,000 likes. 85,000 likes? Man, I shot low! Why am I yelling? Because it's fun! You're right! But guess what? We hit 387,000 likes! Whoa! Wow! Let's buy it! Rock board <clears throat> descender skateboard blue. I believe the descender is for going down hills, for descending. I think they wanted to make that implicit in the title. Tank like treads. Tank you! <laughs> Don't tank me, tank you! Can you remove the trucks? This is a very different from a regular skateboard. And beware! <laughs> The treads are very fragile. Bummer. Is it electric? No. It is too hard to make it go. <laughs> there has to be an extremely short grass for it to move. Not worth the money. I'm very disappointed. Although the name says all terrain, the skateboard is not for flat surfaces. <laughs> the easiest ones. Yeah, got them. The easiest surfaces it's not for. Rocks, grass, mud, sludge, water. Yes. Flat concrete. Oof. Gag gift exceeded expectations. Wow. Add to cart. Look at this thing. The Descender. All terrain skateboard. I'd be more impressed with the Ascender. You just get on it and just <laughs> up hills. <laughs> Takes it straight to heaven. <laughs> I wasn't ready, but I guess I'll go now. Take me away. <laughs> wow, dude, this smells rank. It seems to go relatively well. I mean, it's not gonna coast by any means, but if you if you got any sort of decline, you should be good. Maybe we should try to, you know, take this into like the warehouse or something like that because did you know that it was raining today? No, I didn't. Really? It's raining? Yeah, it's raining. You can almost hear it. Look almost. how dark it is out there, bro. It does look like it has normal trucks. <laughs> Just right into all the tools. Can you do a kickflip? Nope. All right, you wanna go test this in the warehouse? Yeah. On a non-existent hill? Yeah. <laughs> Zagon Studios Men's Gush Pants. <laughs> <laughs> Imported, hand wash. Wait. Why would you wash it? If you're gonna walk around, like, I, this is, these are the things that I don't understand. Who is this marketed towards? I'm having issues. Did you know it's raining outside? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Look, if you have the gall, the confidence, the ability to walk around in public with fake urine on your pants, you have the confidence, the tenacity to just pee in your pants. Do Why it. not just do it? The whole thing about doing it is that people will see you doing it. So if you already aren't afraid of that, just do it. Great for cosplay. Oh, I can't wait to be the superhero that is the peer. No reviews. I wonder why. Add to cart. Thank you for the gush. Ew, they have poop ones too, look. Oh, these are the poop versions. I think that's the back. Oh, it is a back. Back, yeah. Oh no, maybe, is it the same it's thing? Both. Oh, I'm shook for same. you. <laughs> All right, Tanner, time to model for me. <laughs> I actually don't want to touch it, even though it's just paint. That is disturbing. Oh my gosh. I, I felt like I almost vomited there. Tanner, why are you doing that? Hey. It You're doesn't even, it, honestly, off. the front, the front honestly looks like it's just striped that way. Yeah, what about the back? <laughs> too much, just too much. It looks like I slid into home. You know what I'm saying? It doesn't even look like poop, it looks like dirt. I don't know, let's see. Let's grab something to come in here. We need some first impressions, Jen. Come in here. Quick. First impressions. <laughs> Did you pick yourself? Oh, does so it does look it look like that? Oh my god! Attractive or not? No. No? Now the pants. <laughs> <laughs> that was good! I was just curious. looked like pee, but the other side looks like poop. No, that looks like pee. Does it? You think so? Yeah. This looks like a little bit You're very dehydrated. I mean, yeah. Alright, so <laughs> <laughs> right, now much? we're picking up the diet again. <laughs> How much pee do you have to drink <laughs> to get like that? Zero pee. Probably water. <laughs> <laughs> I will never drink pee to get like I'm this. Done, dude. <laughs> Alright, well, thank you, Jen. No problem. Appreciate it. Zero out of ten wouldn't date someone with pee pants. <laughs> That's a no. Younger baby tooth box. Wooden teeth. Oh. Oh. Milk teeth? Organizer? I'm sorry, what? I guess I just don't know. I don't think I'd care about having Luna's teeth. If I ever get a tooth pulled, I don't want to see it. I just want it gone. All right, add to cart. Bone apple teeth. I don't know if Amanda will want to keep Luna's teeth. I'm actually curious. I'm gonna vox her right now. Amanda, quick question for the video. When Luna loses her teeth, are you going to keep them? And if so, why? No. 
why are you filming this right now? That's a weird question to ask. <laughs> Luna in the background. <laughs> you will keep my teeth? <laughs> well, how come you won't keep them? Why? I mean, why do I need to keep them? Sentimental reasons. <laughs> Just give me a hard time. I don't know. I'll keep a lock of her hair, but, you know, when she gets her first haircut, but I don't think I'll keep her teeth. <laughs> this, is the, this is the sound of that. Keep Keeping her teeth. nail clippings or something. <laughs> oh, okay, thank you. Gross. <laughs> She's like, that's like keeping Keep nail, nail clippings. clippings. Oh, nasty. nasty. I thought she said I would keep nail clippings. <laughs> no, no, no. I was like, this is my stupid. wife isn't a, isn't a creepy. Wait, she didn't, did she? No, she nail said that's like keeping. Yeah. So I just sent her some video of me opening this. Let's see what she says about it. This is like outsourcing your jokes. <laughs> Ew, dude. Look, it comes with this thing. That's so weird. Please do not keep that. I don't want you to bring that home. <laughs> She's like, don't even bring it home. I won't. Look, dude, comes with cotton in case there's still blood that you need to soak up. So yeah, I mean, all of these are the areas of which the teeth are, and that's where you keep. I mean, like, no, I just, I'm not gonna keep. What do you realistically do with a child's tooth? Throw it away? Throw it away in the trash can? That's not like some sort of biohazard waste in, in a sense? It's not weird enough for me to like say like all the parents maybe watching this that kept their kids' teeth, like I don't think it's that weird. For me personally, I don't like teeth. Your tooth falls out, don't get it near me, you know? <laughs> Just throws it away instantly. <laughs> Before we get into that next Sweet product. Big shout out to Ruin Van Lar. Oh, if you want to do something fun, try to speak my name out loud. I already did it. Wasn't as fun as it, you thought it was going to be. <laughs> if you want your own shout out, make sure you comment down below in the first 30 minutes and that's when I pick you. So make sure you click that bell icon. Next product. Can Crusher. Crusher's soda cans and beer cans. <laughs> oh man, that's hilarious. Who's using this? Oh, I'll be using it. You think so? 100%. I mean, I grew up in a family where my parents, like my dad, Loves beer, so he'd always be crushing cans because you have to. Okay, if more you room. love beer, you're not drinking out of a can. I'm sorry. If you love beer, you're like finding some nice beers. Well, if you're a fan of beer, then you'll like experiment well, just, with the different drafts and the different. Here's his thing about it, right? This is exactly what he said. He's like, I like beer, but when I drink actual like other beers that aren't light beers, he says he just gains weight so quickly because he's old now. So he's like, I have to drink light beer. Yeah, so. I mean, I guess I take that back. If you put like those weird things, like you know, fancy ketchups, you know, and like fancy mayonnaise and like arugula on a burger, like you're not eating a burger. You're eating like a fancy pants sandwich. I can respect that. So I respect the beer thing. I take it back, I respect your dad. Why do we have to shake on it? Hold on. People do when they agree. You already did this. <laughs> you will spray that in my face. <laughs> that was way weirder than a handshake. <laughs> Add to cart. But I mean, like, if you need to get one of these, this means you're drinking a lot of soda or beer, neither of which are good for you. I'm sorry, if you have a problem with me saying soda's not good for you, do some research. It's like, good holy for the crap. spirit, Matt. It's good for the spirit, dude. You the have soul. no idea. I have no idea how many people get triggered when I'm like, sugar's not good for you. Shut up, in moderation, it's okay. What I was gonna say is maybe just drink a little less soda or a little less beer if you need one of these things to save room in your trash can. Maybe. Alternatively, maybe this is used for someone that is saving cans mm -hmm. to get like 10 cents back. In that case, have at it, man. Recycle. Mm -hmm. Save money. I dig it. Look at this, though. Boom. Crush, crush, crush. Now let's put a can in it. <laughs> LaCroix. What a hipster drink. You love LaCroix? No, I don't. Then why do we buy so much of it? I don't know. I hate this stuff. You actually hate LaCroix? Yeah, I haven't drank one in like months. Oh, no. I... It wasn't me. Everyone else loves LaCroix. When I first started Hi-Fi Studios, I was like, all right, what do you guys want? And like everyone would always request LaCroix. And I was like, oh my gosh, can't you just drink water? <laughs> what are you gonna do when you like, when you make a studio in LA? You know, what, what, am I, what do I expect really, you know? <laughs> May I have a LaCroix? I would like to eat my mayonnaise with a spoon. Le Gouda cheese. <laughs> have your American cheese again. <laughs> <sighs> you need to actually attach this to a wall. Hold it right here. Oh, that worked. Boom. Yeah, good for you, dude. There you go, it worked. Next item. Made in the USA, okay. Proud to be an American. <laughs> Used to troubleshoot electronic circuit board and intermittent components or failures. I don't know how, but that's cool. Protects heat sensitive components during soldering. Ew, what the heck are they scraping up there? That's the one thing they're not gonna caption? <laughs> what is that, a piece of gum? Typical America, dude. Make a force of it. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Look at this army of super freeze. <laughs> Made in the USA, best element super freeze is an ozone friendly aerosol cool system that instantly freezes surfaces to negative 65 degrees Fahrenheit. Evaporates in seconds. Wow. You think we can freeze like some fruit or some like water? I think we could freeze some of that. You think so? Well, yeah, I know we can freeze water. You think so? But how fast does it need to be subjected to such temperatures to freeze? That's the question that you're not anticipating. 
add to cart. Wow, look at you, Tanner. Good for you. Super freeze. Non-flammable, evaporates instantly, leaves no residue, and is non-conductive. Explosive, though. <laughs> Did you really just give me two left hands? <laughs> they only gave us three gloves. <laughs> I mean, I only gave us Who's three they? gloves. Who's they? Me. Oh, it's so warm already. All right, let's see. Here, I brought some apples. Wow. How am I going to tell? <laughs> And then this is a regular apple. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> exact same sound. <laughs> I mean, how will I know? I don't know if that was a great experiment. Let's move on to some uh, water first. What if I tried to freeze it as it was going down? It's got a lot of kinetic energy to do that. It's gonna be pretty hard. Whoops. <laughs> All right, let's see if it freezes when it's... Oh. Big niche! Nothing. I think there's just too much water. I'm gonna put this in here and freeze it. That has got to be frozen now. Give me the hammer. So it was frozen at that point. No, it's just how a normal an apple normally. Oh, and now there's apple everywhere. It squirted everywhere. <laughs> this is the worst experiment. There is some frozen stuff in there, definitely. Oh yeah, look, there's some ice on the tip of the hammer and it melted. Yeah, it did freeze a little bit right there and broke, but it didn't freeze well. This is really for freezing like really, really, really tiny like little components and electronics so you can, I guess, not heat them up, you know, when you're soldering. It'll freeze your finger. It'll give you a frostbite, definitely. So don't be messing around with it like that. It's not gonna be like freezing water midair and things like that like we hoped it would. I would say that's still dope though. Gund peekaboo teddy bear animated stuffed animal plush. Hello baby, peekaboo is Ooh. the most fun with you. <laughs> I wonder if Luna would like this. Seems like the mom likes it more than the kid does though. <laughs> She's that. Kid likes it though. That's not fake. That kid likes it. I heard peekaboo works because babies' memories are so... No, 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 no. That, that they actually think the parent is gone. No, but that has nothing to do with their memory. There's a technical term for it. It's, it's about them not knowing when they don't see something, it doesn't exist. So oh. it's about understanding things exist outside of vision. If mom goes into the garage and Luna doesn't see her anymore, she'll she think she's, she's gone. gone. Like, doesn't exist anymore. Luna's like one and a half and hide and seek still works for her for her though. I think it's more of like, she thinks when she can't see, you can't see kind of a thing. But Absolutely. it's interesting too, cause like I'll pretend like she'll be behind me and she'll be like whacking me like this. And I'll be like, I don't know where Luna is. And she just loves it. Even though she's like whacking me and she's like, I'm right here kind of a thing. She yeah. just absolutely loves it. So she might actually like this. Let's see if it works before I give it to my daughter though. Add to cart. <laughs> I just told you I, I may give this to my daughter. And that's how you treat this thing, dude? Press my foot to play. Hello, baby. Peekaboo is the most fun with you. <laughs> Where did you go? Peekaboo, I found you. I'm curious. <laughs> I think this may work. I'm gonna take this home, get Luna's reaction, and uh, here it is. Icicle, 10 pack of the Drinkster swizzle stick that uses dry ice to create smoky effects on cocktails. Swizzle stick. Dude, I'm stealing that. <laughs> okay, good, because I thought maybe when you laughed, I had said it like it wasn't like some youth term. I mean, it's not, but the fact, it's got potential to be a youth hey. term. You know, you can't say it in a way that's not Perverse, provocative. Yeah, yeah, provocative. Take a gander at my swizzle stick. Because yeah. <laughs> the youths say gander. Yeah, they love to gander at swizzle sticks. Whoa, what's inside there? It's just like this Great kind of like sack. No, there looks like a sack in there. <laughs> That's how Ice-T the rapper was born, dude. It was just regular tea, they put a little swizzle stick in, and then boom, <laughs> Ice-T. <laughs> really? You really put that in a champagne glass? Yeah, I just don't think that's cool. I think alcohol just by itself is auto, is like already cool to people the, this age. Yes. To me, it's not cool, it's so lame. I, don't do the alcohol, kids. Yeah, you know what's cool for your age? Books. Babies. Babies? No, don't tell them that either, dude. Don't have babies early, kids. What's the matter with you? Early, you're 29. You had a baby at 28. But this person watching is maybe 15. I said at your age. Oh, you did say at my age. At 15, drinking's still cool. <laughs> Wait. No, no, no. No. <laughs> At 15, Yu-Gi-Oh cards are still cool. Yu-Gi-Oh, no, come on, dude. Now you're on the opposite end of the spectrum. <laughs> I don't know what's cool at 15 anymore. I don't know, driving. Oh, Driving's yeah. cool. Uh, yeah. I Just drive it. safe. Add to cart. Bam. So what's this? Those are the swizzle sticks. Swizzle sticks. I got wait, a oh, wait. Oh, what? 
Mm -hmm. Wait, so they're empty? They're all empty. They don't come with the dry ice. So you put dry ice in your drink? Is that healthy? Well, I don't know much about dry ice. All right, inform it me. It should be healthy. Pretty it much should be healthy or shouldn't be toxic? Well, it's not healthy. But <laughs> okay. Like, <laughs> There's a different, different term. But it's not here. toxic either. Dry ice is just a different... Is it carbon dioxide? What is dry ice? Frozen what? Solid carbon dioxide. Yeah, see? That's what I said. Solid carbon dioxide. Oh, yeah. Don't go eat it, though, because it'll freeze your mouth solid. All right, so let's figure this out. And don't touch it with your skin either because it'll freeze your skin. Fill me up with some dry ice in my swizzle, my nizzle. Okay, so I gotta put this in here like this. Yeah. Is this gonna like fuzz it over? Okay, look at that. There you go, that's it. So then you can like, oop, hey oh. Ooh, that's really bubbling up now. Hey oh, she's about to explode here, so let's do it in this. Double dipping, risky play. <laughs> wow, that's so cool looking though. Maybe that is the cool thing. Maybe hipsters are in. But how cold is this now? And how fast will that dry ice melt? I can feel the cup with my bare hand if you'd like. Oh, well, it's not gonna be that cold. I'm saying touch the fluid. It's not gonna be that cold. I touch the that. fluid. And how cold is it? Pretty cold. I should have touched it before. We're well, scientists. Like <laughs> I'm just curious how long this lasts because it seems like they're already kind of like, they're already out. There's no uh, carbonation in here. So let's see what that does. That's kind of cool. All right, Tim, you want to drink that? How's his ears looking? Honestly, it's just cool looking. These kids are cool. <laughs> how do you how do you do it though? It's you know? making me cough. How do you do it though? You know? <laughs> That's cool. <laughs> <laughs> don't smoke. Hit nice, bro. <laughs> you can't stop it, bro. I just don't know if it's healthy. Consult a doctor. <laughs> it's cool looking though. Cheers. <laughs> I barely tapped it, dude. <laughs> Got on my hair. It's worse than my face. <laughs> I'll say it's a dope, but use it with caution and parents. Auto exec wheelmate steering wheel attachable work surface. I feel like I've seen this before. I don't think I bought it though. This is the dumbest thing in the world. Could you imagine? Look at this girl. What is the matter with this girl? It looked like she got a text and she was just like, oh. Huh? <laughs> Guys, give me some memes on Twitter and Instagram. All right, here's what I want. I want you to do something like this. Take this photo and then put some funny text message conversation right beside it in the same image. <laughs> okay. You know what I'm saying? So she's just like, <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, what do you think she got a text from her mom? Her mom's like, hey, honey, come home early because no one's home. And then she's like, do you think I was dead? <laughs> you know? Yeah. Or it's your boyfriend like, hey, babe, make sure you pick up the new 2K for me. And she's like, jotting it down. <laughs> <laughs> Jotting it down, yeah, yeah. Taking notes, dude. <laughs> what is a 2K and how do I get one? Do I need to buy that many? <laughs> Add to cart. Here we go, this is it. I mean, it's I, it's kind of what you expect, right? Warning, do not use or mount this work surface to steering wheel while vehicle is in motion. Okay, got it. You Failure. know someone didn't listen to that. May cause serious injury or death. <laughs> this product is intended to be used while the vehicle is stationary and the driver is not operating the vehicle. The steering wheel must be turned upside down for it to be installed properly. <laughs> Now it's upside down. <laughs> it's oh. the same thing. No, it's because, it's be wait, why? Because the top of the steering wheel is empty, basically. Yeah. The bottom usually has those those other things right here. So you turn it upside down. So you turn it upside down so that, yeah. So, I mean, ew, what the heck is that? Why is it all brown? Oh, sorry, that's how I made these pants on that. It's so good. Like that? Wait, what? That doesn't make any sense. There you go. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is the dumbest thing. If you buy this thing, like, it's like people that don't wear helmets. Dumb. I mean, it's kind of self-evident that they're dumb already. Mm -hmm. So someone should tell them. That's dumb. That's a nope. It's a nope nope. All right, guys, here we go. We found a small little hill. We're in the outskirts of San Luis Obispo right now. I want to try this. Okay, see what you got, tiger. How was it? Yeah, I mean, I can definitely see how that could be fun. We had a longer up. hill. Specifically grass too, just you know, because you can tumble and it won't hurt. Yeah. But it could work probably on dirt. Eh. Yeah. Oh jeez. <laughs> yeah, I can see how that could be a lot of fun. You wanna give it a try? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> what? <laughs> it just stuck. Whew. That's actually pretty fun, yeah. 
Yeah, I think that could be a lot of fun. Do you think this is something that you could only do with this board, though? Or do you think you could do it with a regular skateboard? You can't do that with a regular skateboard. The, the feet will dig right into the grass. So what do you rate it? <laughs> I guess it's dope. I think it'd be pretty fun. There we go. It's like dope. It. It's yeah. dope. Oh. It's the dope. This video right here is where I test to see if cardboard can actually protect my head. And this video right here is about a device that you wear that counts down to the end of your days. That is right, to your death. All right, guys. If you're new here, click that subscribe button, and we will see you next time. High five.